first game is called Pick a Hand. Start with your dog sitting in front of you and place some treats in one hand behind your back. Offer both your hands and reward your dog when they go to the hand containing the treats. Yes! Good boy! If your dog gets stuck on the incorrect hand, open it and show them there's nothing there. The second game is a shell game. Place some treats under one of two cups and then ask your dog to find it. Reward when they go to the correct cup. Stay. Find it. Find it. Good boy! Very good! Stay. To make the game more challenging, move the cups around after you've placed the treats and ask your dog to find it. If they get distracted like Finley does here, just encourage them to go to the correct cup and find the treats. Find it! Yes! Good boy! Stay. Good boy! Find it! Find it! Find it! So I completely screwed up there. I interrupted Finley while he was finding it, so he thought he had the wrong cup. Um, and you'll see why this is a problem in a second. But if this does happen to you, don't worry about it. Just encourage them to go back to the crack cup and find the treats and then reward for that. Find it. Find it. Ah, find it. Yes! Find it! Yes! Good boy! Stay. And to make this game even more difficult for super smart dogs, you can add as many cups as you want so you have a lot more ways that you can move the cups around before asking your dog to find it. The third game is under the towel. Start with your dog sitting in front of you and ask them to stay. Place some treats under a towel and then ask them to find it. Reward when they find the treats. If your dog is struggling, tap over the towel where the treats are to encourage them to go to that spot. Good boy, where is it? Good job! Okay, Vinny. Thank you. Good job! As you can see, Finley was getting frustrated and started scratching, so I took a second, reset, and tried again. Good boy! You can also make these games more challenging by asking your dog to find a tea bag instead of treats. All the rules stay the same, but instead of looking for food, they're looking for a tea bag. If you are going to play these games with a tea bag, take it out of its packaging and allow your dog to get a really good sense of its smell before asking them to find it. And the last game is called... Oh, what's in the box? And you're going to need a bunch of stuff for this. You're going to need some empty boxes, some very, very smelly treats, chicken or liver or something like that, and a small perforated plastic container. And this is what I use. It's some chicken in a little Tupperware container that I've poked some holes in. Now this allows you to hide the food in the boxes, but not let the smell contaminate the box itself. So the first thing you're going to do is hide your little container of food in a box and then ask your dog to go find it. Can you go find it? Good job, where is it? Yes, good boy! Good job! 
when your dog does find it, throw them a party. Tell them they did great and give them lots and lots of treats so they know they did really well. Finny, ready? Go find it! Go find it! Yes! Good boy! Find it! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah! Good job! Good boy! Now it's Scarlett's turn, and she's really good at this, so I'm gonna close all the boxes so that she doesn't have a visual cue and has to go by smell alone. Ready, ready? Go find it, Scarlett. Go find it. And to up the challenge even more, you can start stacking the boxes on top of each other so that the dog has to search up and down as well as back and forth on the ground. Go find it! Good girl, did you find it already? Okay, Scarlett, find it! Find it! Where is it? Good girl! Show me! To teach your dog to show me where it is, simply go over to the spot and point, encourage them to go to it again, and then reward them, like in this clip. Find it. Find it. Good girl, show me. Good girl. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Have fun playing all kinds of nose work games with your dogs. Make sure you like and subscribe before you go, and we'll see you next time. Bye.